qualify. Well, state election officials expect voter turnout to hover around 20 percent for tomorrow's presidential primary in Michigan. But some remain worried that some of the votes won't end up counting. WSBT's Troy Kehoe is here with the latest on a last-minute push to make Democrats uncommitted. That's right, Jim, and that does not mean that those voters are undecided. It just means that their candidate isn't on the ballot. But some worry it could mean something else. Chaos at the polls. Pass out the straw poll. It's Monday night. Two write-ins. And despite the fact that the polls don't open for another 12 hours, Edwards here. it's election night at the South County Democratic Club in Buchanan. Hillary's got in my piles. The results? 18 for John Edwards. Thank you, folks. All in fun. 28 to 14, uncommitted. But... To illustrate a point. It does matter. This uncommitted vote is important. Democratic voters still have a voice. If you want to vote Democrat, but your candidate's name's not on the ballot, you do have an option. And your option is to vote uncommitted. But are those voters getting the message? We hit the snow-covered streets to find out. Kay Neville plans to pull a Democratic ballot. If the candidates that you want to vote for aren't on there, do you know what you'll do? No, frankly, I don't. <laughs> Caroline Doan plans to pull a Democratic ballot, too. Are you still a little confused about what to do? Well, yes, I would be. I guess I would just not vote. It's exactly what election workers are worried about because of this. Have to ask some questions yet. And this. All we can do is, is tell the voters what the options are or what the law or the regulations are. That means poll workers can't tell voters exactly how to vote for a candidate who's not on the ballot. All they can do is point out the uncommitted line. But Jess Minx is convinced that will be enough to ensure Michigan isn't left behind. We have to make the stand to bring it back to where everybody has a voice. But to make that happen, at least 15 percent of Michigan's Democratic ballots will have to be marked uncommitted on this line right here. If that does happen, Jim, Michigan's Democratic delegates will be able to choose who will eventually get the state's nomination. And really, I guess tomorrow we'll be watching the weather because that could really have an impact on turnout. It certainly could, especially uh, with tonight's snow coming mm -hmm. down. A lot of people may look outside already and say, I'm not going to bother. Uh, making, of course, getting out the vote tomorrow yeah. may be just as important as making it count. Yeah, we'll be watching tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Troy.